Hi, Alex here, and I wanted to make this short review video of G-Scraper because I think it's a real clever concept and it will practically 100% automate your keyword research. This smart bot will go out into the Google Keyword Tool and download the CSV files for SKCA to analyze. Let me show you how I do it. First, you have to add some keywords here in the seed keywords raw txt file. Let's say I'm looking for some physical products to promote. So I'm going to use these three keywords. Now that that's done, you have to go into the settings txt file. I have that already open. And if you scroll down, you will find this thing here. This is the cool part about G-Scraper. You can put your formula here for finding profitable keywords with low competition. The one I use is, well, I first put local here instead of global. And do the same down here. Okay, once that's done, I will put 500 here. And 3,500 here. So this is higher than 500 exact match searches a month, but lower than 3,500 exact match searches a month. And I want my CPC to be higher than 50 cents. As I'm looking to build Amazon sites, I will target the United States and the language is English. So I just hit save and then close and I'm ready to start. So now I just double click on the G-Scraper and it will automatically launch a robot that will go into Google Keyword Tool, put the parameters I just set and download the CSV file. It will save this CSV file in two places. And I will show them to you when the process is done. So you see it's logging in. Logging into my AdWords account. Now it's going to uh, put the match type to exact. And add my country and language. And also automatically set up all the other filters. So you see the filters are right there. Now it will add uh, my first keyword, my first seed keyword, and it will hit search. Once the results are back, it's going to download uh, the 79 keywords into a CSV file. And save it. And that's it, we're done. Now using the same parameters is going to analyze the next seed keyword. You see, digital kitchen scale. You're gonna use the same parameters and hit search. And it's gonna go through the process again. Uh, what I'm gonna do is gonna pause the video and resume it once my three seed keywords are gathered and we have the results downloaded. Okay, this scraper is done. It has created three CSV files based on my three seed keywords and it has saved them here. These CSV files are in a SKCA ready format. So you see we have all the, the keywords and they are based on the parameters we put for minimum local monthly searches, maximum local monthly searches and cost per click. So we have our three CSV files here and G-Scraper also saved them here. So StealthBot can upload them into Stealth Keyword Competition Analyzer and analyze them automatically. And one more thing I want to show you here in the G-Scraper folder is remember that we added our keywords here in the raw file. Now they're no longer there and they are now in the done file. So you can have a record of the keywords you have already done. And a real cool thing is that once G-Scraper is done creating your CSV files, you can command the bot to launch StealthBot so that StealthBot can start to analyze the competition for the keywords in those CSV files automatically. So without doing nothing, you have just gathered CSV files with potentially good keywords to target and then analyze them in Stealth Keyword Competition Analyzer. 
you can leave this program running overnight and wake up to find hundreds of amazing keywords that you can potentially target. So you see, that's why the combination of G-Scraper, Stealthbot and SKCA is so powerful. It's like having your own personal robot doing all the keyword research for you. And that's why I wanted to share with you this amazing new technology that can really save you a lot of time and give you a lot of good results. So start to put these bots to work for you and take advantage of this amazing technology. And thank you for your time.